In the previous video, we talked about customizing the WordPress theme. We briefly touched upon widgets, but in this video, we'll be taking a more in-depth look at widgets on your WordPress website. Widgets can add blocks of content to your sidebar and footer of your site. Widgets can be placed in any widget-capable area that your theme allows. For example, widgets can be used to showcase your most recent posts, categories of posts, recent comments, and many more things. The widget subpanel is accessible from the WordPress dashboard. This allows you to edit, add, and rearrange the order of the widgets. On the left side of this page, you have access to all of the available widgets, while on the right is the available widget areas on your website. You can simply drag over from your available widgets to one of the widget areas supported by your theme. You can see what widgets are currently contained on your site on the right side as well. With the WordPress 2017 theme, we have three widget areas, the sidebar and two footer widget areas. You can reorder the widgets by clicking and dragging them into the desired area in their respective widget area. To get rid of one of the widgets, you can simply drag it out of the widget area. More settings for the individual widgets are available by clicking on the arrow next to the widget name. To add a new widget, drag the widget into the widget area you want it to appear on on your site. You won't be able to see these changes until you head back to your site though. You're also able to edit your widgets from the customizer on your live site. You can select what widget area you want to edit and you'll find the list of widgets that are in use in that area. Editing widgets from the customizer allows you to see a real-time preview of what they'll look like. Open the widget area you wish to edit, and you can reorder the widgets or add widgets to that area. To edit the content of a widget, click the widget you wish to edit. You can customize things like the details or settings of this widget. For example, giving the widget a title. Or you can change how the widget is displayed. You can also remove a widget at any time by clicking the Remove button on the selected widget in the customizer. Let's now add a new widget to our footer. Select the footer widget area and then hit Add New Widget. You'll be then tasked with selecting one of your available widgets to add to this widget area. One of the most flexible widgets is the text widget. With this, you can add in any text or HTML for display on your site. Once you're happy with the widget, hit Save and Publish. You can see how widgets can provide flexibility on your website, so play around with them. With .easy and WordPress, using widgets on your website has never been easier. So stay tuned for more helpful videos. Thanks for watching.